Hello, my name is Jim and I'm a respiratory therapist. I want to show you today the use of the bag valve mask for ventilation of patients. I have a bag valve mask here and three different mask sizes. I'm going to show you how to apply those to the patient. Okay, so here I have the disposable manual bagger which has a peep valve attached and there's no mask on it currently. It does have a reservoir bag and then an oxygen supply line. And then with that, we generally take three separate masks. I have three examples here, small, medium, and large mask. And then um, since COVID, we've basically been using filters on all of our bag valve masks. So that would be applied between the bagger itself and the mask. The masks are in a shape that's pointed on one end and round on the other. The pointed end would go to the patient's nose and the round end would go between the lip and the jaw. Once you've chosen the right size mask, you would assemble the bagger with the mask and the filter, and then you would apply that to the patient. Now, the grip that we're going to use typically is um, called the EC grip. So it's using three fingers of one hand as a capital letter E, and then your thumb and finger as the letter C. So the letter C goes on the mask, and the letter E goes on the jaw, the lower jaw of the patient, and the idea is to hold the mask down and pull the head back and lift the jaw up with your three fingers. And at that point, then I would be able to give a breath. One slow breath, just enough air pressure to give chest rise. And a lot of times when you're doing this, if your hand's not very large, a lot of times you'll get air leaking out the other side of the mask. So the fix for that would be to use your second hand and apply an EC grip on the other side. So now you're using two hands to seal the mask on and the person who would be squeezing the bag would have to be another operator. That's one way to do it. And if you are having trouble getting a seal with the mask, another way to do it is instead of using the EC grip like that, would be to do what they call thumbs down. And you put your thumbs down the mask and then you grab both sides of the head with your hands and you can lift the jaw up and push down. This one still requires two people to do this, but this is called a vice grip, and it's the way that a lot of people are overcoming difficulties with leaks around the face from the mask. 